What's up, Sexy Sam Lana Squad? Welcome to my first look video. Charybdis. I'm looking at Charybdis, who's apparently an ADC, but is also just like a Scylla, it looks like. But like a royal... Oh, ew. That's under her arm? Ew, dude. Ew, dude. Okay, I have no idea what any of my abilities do but i do know that you build like every hunter in the game which is not thinking and just buying shit so what does my three button do oh my god i'm a butthole what does that do i have a world push creates expanding revealing the terrifying monster uh charybdis moves faster deals damage to enemies caught in the area the ability can be amplified by toggling it again and spending 30 percent tide doing so increases the damage dealt and movement speed as well as providing extra damage and knock up on exiting so you can to toggle it again. I don't have tied, so I can't. Um, successful basic attacks increase her tide. Deals less damage with item effect procs. Okay. And I assume... I think I saw once that her auto attacks go through everything. Like, kind of like Izanami. No. Wait. So I auto auto and then do 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 auto auto and then do 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 auto auto and then do 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 okay got it so she's got an attack chain of one one and then point three point three point three oh my god what does that ability do what the heck what the heck dude okay my one boom Wait, what the? Wait. Reveals them all as it fires a large spike for a short duration, dealing basic attack damage. These projectiles pass through minions and are wider and faster than normal basic attacks. If it hits an enemy god or a wall. Okay. Spike splinters dealing additional damage. Okay, okay. The, the two is that she absorbs water from around her before firing quick blasts from them all. Enemies are hit. By a rapidly decayed slow and physical prot debuff. Ability can be channeled for longer. Assuming tide on fire to become wider and strengthen the debuff effect. Okay. So I can toggle this again. Give me that knock up. Okay. Okay, that's kind of cool. What does my alt do? Reveals her true nature, becoming immune to CC for six seconds and gaining movement speed. 35% movement speed. That's huge. She may make one powerful attack as the mall charges forward and damaging. Carrying the enemies back. Enemies hit before chomping down, damaging again. And stunning. So it grabs, so it hits them, brings them back, hits them again. Hold on. So I grab. Hold on. I missed. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I missed. I don't want to talk about it. Nobody mentioned anything. First time playing the god. Give me some slack. I'm AFK for, for H of all here. I'm gonna take my tower. I don't care. Um. Bro, this god has so much going on. This does give you increased movement speed, right? Yeah, 20% increased movement speed. So this... The damage on this is actually pretty good. Wait, how many times can you use that? Oh, it's a, it's a stim. It's a stim for four seconds. I thought it was like three auto attacks or something. But it's a stim. Oh, so she has a really good clear then, huh? She's a really good clear. And then you can charge this up to hit harder and give a bigger a debuff. Right? So when you when you charge it. It gives you 40% max tide if it's fully charged and deals slightly more damage. Okay. Do 
Dude, that one is really cool. I don't know if using your two actually it doesn't feel good to be honest with you like it doesn't deal enough damage for it to feel strong this gives you damage every second does it give you damage when you just use it oh well i guess you're not targetable so wait i just realized she's immune to damage and untargetable during that whole thing what the heck? Boom! I missed. Oh man, I missed my autos. I missed my autos. Dude, that's so wild. So when he when he jumps on me. All I got to do is press three. I had literally no idea, bro. Literally not a damn clue. Does it work on towers? It does. Would have thought. This is cool, dude. This is a really cool, cool god. This does damage to minions, right? Yeah, it does. Gives you that debuff. I think the debuff needs to be stronger. Well, I know. I mean, it's 40% max physical uh, reduction, so never mind. Nice damage. Nice damage. It seems like she moves faster than normal, but maybe it's because she's so tiny. It's probably because she's so tiny. Kind of like how you would, you feel like, um, some other gods move really fast too. I can't remember exactly what other gods move that fast, but I really want to hit my ult. I'm slightly annoyed that I can't. <laughs> Because it seems so cool. Look at this. Just completely untargetable. Damn it, dude. Just completely untargetable when you go into that three. That's so absurd, isn't it? Alright, so the more you level up two, the more damage it does. It's got very, very high scaling, it seems like. A very, very high scaling. Um, I have 84 power and it has 71 extra scaling damage on it. And the base damage is really high, so... She gains another six seconds and may attack again. So she's got kind of like Scylla on her alt. So what... Okay, hold on. You may make one powerful attack as a mall charges forward, damaging and carrying back enemies hit. Before chomping down and damaging again and stunning. Okay. My one is bugged. Um, it will not let me use my one. There we go. Dude. That one does a lot of damage. I mean, it's just basics, but wait, a hundred percent damage on minion scaling. Wait, you'd get extra strong autos against minions. 190. What's my normal auto damage? I hit those minions for 190. I got to go punch one of these things. Once. No, that's. Oh, so it didn't give me more damage. Did it? 177, 195. No. That didn't give me more damage. That was just the itch of all proc. 
what does it mean by 100 scaling oh so when you okay when you're leveling it up it's it's your normal damage so when it's max rank you're doing normal auto attack damage with it on minions when it's not max rank you're doing less auto attack damage but you have that kind of aoe auto attack damage that's what it's saying okay all right understood understood oh my what did that mark do what did that mark do also did that hit for 500 yeah it did that hit for 516 I have 65 power. I have 60. I have 65 power. And that hit for 500 damage. Look at this. A charge damage. So when it initially hits, it did 120. And then it bites them and then stuns them. And if you get a kill with it, you can use it again. What the fucking heck? What in the fucking heck, man? How much did my two just do? Oh, I hit him twice, but it did 500. Yeah, okay, so her it seems like her scaling is crazy. Her scaling is crazy good, dude. Like, maybe she's not the most insane early game god, but... Holy bajugas, dude. Holy bajugas. Late game, she smack And look at the damage this does. Like base damage. How far range can this go? Pretty far, bro. Oh, nice. Uh oh. Okay, I was pretty nervous. Pretty nervous I was going to die there. Thank gosh I did not. I'm just gonna go like Kins and Aussie. Oh, I wanted to try Oboe too, with the with the triple auto. I want to know if every auto will proc Oboe. Not every auto, but you know, like if it will proc it faster. You know what I mean? Am I three? Actually, did three hundred damage. Your three does not tickle. Your three does not tickle. Are you doing fire? Hmm. I really just want to like hit things with my alt. You know what I mean? <laughs> I wish you could just hit stuff with your alt. She's great at staggering waves. I will say that with her triple auto. Look at this, man. Oh, the range is low. I just wanted to see if um if the one let you still hit Phoenix or Tower or whatever. Dude, the fact that you cannot run through minions. It's almost like reverse is an army buff, if you know what I mean. Like 
is Anami when you originally use her don't jump on me please when you originally attack with her it goes through things right and it does less damage but then when you use your one on uh Carbidus, I think is her name its name it, I mean it's a monster right I, I don't know but um hold on I want to see the oboe Okay, it definitely does work. That's insane. <laughs> what the frick, dude? Anyways, um, what was I talking about? That that blew my mind. Hold on. I forgot what I was talking about. Boom. Oh, oh. So how come it only did one tick of damage there? Yeah, it only hit once and it's supposed to. She may make one powerful attack as the mall charges forward, damaging, carrying back enemies hit or jumping down. Why did it not carry him back? You know what I mean? Like, why didn't it? Isn't it supposed to? Isn't it supposed to carry back? I want to see her shred, by the way, on Bull Demon. Oh, he did it. I really want to see the shred damage she has, though. It seems crazy. Like, her damage... Her damage output seems absurd, man. And it's like, you can't even do anything to stop it. You're just so... Helpless. I really want to hit level 20. <laughs> That's so interesting. Just punching the wall. Like, look at the burst damage, man. It stacks up mannequins really fast. And granted, I know she does less damage. Like, like the, um, the oboe and, you know, uh, the oboe, the mannequins, stuff like that. I know it procs for less damage, but it's still so cool. You gain extra movement speed when you, uh, you amplify it right yeah doing so increases damage dealt and movement speed yeah cool 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 um all right i really am just waiting for uh bull demon to spawn i really want the bull demon to spawn also i wonder if crit chance on her is cool why are you just losing your phoenix your team has destroyed a middle enemy phoenix. oh my god yeah, Kins is doing almost nothing. 11 hits for 156. That's like 15 damage per Kins proc. Oh, please don't tell me you're going to do Boldy, bro. Get out of here. Literally going to lose the game. You're going to lose the game. I just wanted to run away and not lose the game so that I can do Boldy. I want to see how fast it, I do it. Oh my god, dude. That's insane. 
28 autos. But my autos come out so fast because I do that triple auto too. What a wild ride, man. What a, what a wild ride. Dude, look at this damage. That's so cool. Oh, you can prot shred the Titan? I don't know if you guys saw that, but I hit the Titan with my two and then started autoing it and was doing an, an additional like 20 damage. And that was without charging my two. That's super sick. That's super sick. Now stay with me. I don't want to end the video there because I want to go into, um, I want to go into jungle practice. Where's jungle practice? Practice, jungle practice. And I want to play her. And I want to use the alt because I didn't get the... I only used it... I was only able to hit the alt twice during that game. So I want to really see what that alt is about. You know what I mean? I want to really see what the alt's about. Load me in, Poppy. Set me to level 20. The are all just like ships I don't care about the damage. I want to use. I want to use this. So you hit it. So okay, why isn't it dragging it back then? Why is it not being dragged back? I'm gonna do like a bunch of attack speed so I can mess around. And we'll do uh, reset cooldown, obviously, but then we'll also do. Reduce cooldown. Okay. So. Why is it not? Okay, first off, the damage there was just ridiculous. 1200. I thought it was, it's supposed to grab them. Charges forward, damaging, carrying them back. And chomping down, damaging again. Look how fast Oboe procs, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, Oboe can proc on that too, huh? Interesting. So let me try it on a, a bot here. It still didn't grab him. Why didn't it grab? Why didn't you grab? You said cooldown, go back over. I missed. Do I have to hit it with this little... Like, do I have to push him? You may make one powerful attack as the mall charges forward, damaging, carrying back enemies hit before chomping down, damaging again, and stunning. Maybe I need to aggro them first. It's, it's only, it's only doing that initial hit. Why is it only doing the initial hit? I don't understand. Am, do I have to click it again? No. I just tried clicking it again. Um. What am I missing here? I grow him out. Oh, hey. Huh. Right. Charge damage and then bite damage. So maybe it's not just like it's just not carrying back. Is it hitting twice? It is hitting twice. 
it definitely is hitting twice um i don't know if i can show you guys but it is hitting twice and it is stunning as well it's just not dragging them back which i thought it was supposed to or maybe it means pushing them back well you can't be pushed back while you're while you're spinning So, hold on. Try with a different character. We'll try with Raw. Raw can be pushed back. Okay, come here. Kind of fucked up. Okay, that... So, it... So, it charges forward, damaging, carrying back enemy. Carrying backwards enemies. When it says carrying back, I'm like, okay, it grabs them and carries them back to me. But that is not the case. It pushes them away. And then and then bites them and stuns them. Okay, we learned, boys. We learned. Let's go. Look at this damage, man. Like, holy... You do extra damage with that too, huh? All right. I understand. Do you do more damage by hitting a wall? Ow. If she kills with it, you can use it again. Okay, so let's try that. Oh my, okay. Yeah. That's super cool, dude. This character is nuts. I... I think if I stream today, which I don't know if I can because I spent so much time recording today, but... This is definitely a character that I'm gonna I'm gonna diamond. <laughs> like holy shit, dude. Can you uh can you level up the, the gold fury here? Or no? Well fire. Lower those props and then go for the damage. Nice little fire solo before his second attack chain starts. Crazy, dude. Crazy. This gives you a lot of power, too, which increases your scaling a crap ton. So let me see. It only hits one god, right? Oh, the bite actually hits multiple gods. So the, the charge hit one of them. But then the bite actually hit four of them. Oh shit. That's a game changer. Like I could bite all five of these. Oh my god. You can bite all of them. It doesn't hit one god? I thought it hit one god. Okay, how long does the protection debuff? Duration four seconds. Okay, I gotta try this. They don't have any protections anyways, it seems. Holy crap. Dude, that triple auto is so satisfying to land. Holy... That triple auto is more satisfying than Gilgamesh kick. Holy shit. I'm vibing right now, dude. That triple auto is so sick. Anyways, this has been 30, 30 minutes long of 
me just messing around in jungle practice i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to like comment and subscribe and until next time guys i love you please have sex with me bye